Hello again. Welcome back to all of my doers, movers, and shakers out there in the community. I am Edie, also known as the Community Lady. And today I'm sharing tips and general things that I wish I'd known over my more than 20 years in service to the community, um, community organizing, and also creating and managing nonprofit organizations. And today we are debunking myths about grant writing and the grant management process. Um, and I'm winging it today without any notes, so whew, bear with me. Um, myth number three, grants are government money. So that's how I typically hear that, um, quite frankly. I always hear like, you getting that government money, you good, you good. I'm like, hmm, hmm. I think that people would actually say that to me. And they, they still say, oh, you mean... If you'll say something about grants, they'll say, oh, you mean the government money? So what I wanted to clarify for you all, that while it is true that the government, um, through its various government agencies, does award grants to nonprofits, to cultural institutions, to academic institutions and colleges, um, and to nonprofit organizations, and also faith-based organizations and for-profit organizations, they are not the sole source of funding. So, quick quiz for you. Which category of funders give the most dollars to nonprofit organizations? Is it category A, the government? Category B, foundations? Category C, private corporations? Category D, individual donors? And E, None of the above. Let's see. Put your answers below. I really am curious what your thoughts are. Okay, great. So the answer is category D, I believe, which was individual donors. So with that said, please keep in mind that we all are funders. Um, if I were to give you $5, and tell you to use it any way you like, but I want a donation receipt, then I would be giving you unrestricted funds and I would be your funder. If I gave you the same $5 and said, I want this used to purchase admission for one child into a movie theater, then I'm donating to you restricted funds and I would have the right to say, hey, where's the receipt from that purchase um, from that uh, movie admission purchase. So again, just wanted to describe that to you and clarify that myth. Um, that is, this is a quick one today, guys. So that actually is it. I will below include links to, um, to government grant site, which is grants.gov, but you can then look at the different agencies and look at what they award. There really are a ton of grants. You can search by topic, what you're looking for, but I also, encourage you, and I'll include this in the link as well, to sign up for some of these um, hubs that actually offer grants, like GrantStation or the Grantsmanship Center. I will include links to those as well. Um, I hope you enjoyed today's video. I hope you have learned something. Um, and please, again, suggest any new topics that you would have me cover or post any questions if I didn't cover something that you thought should be covered. Um, until next time, keep doing, keep moving, and keep shaking things up in your community. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Peace. Working in community, no place I'd rather be. Working in community, lifting, loving, setting free. Don't know where.